What is up, YouTube? Welcome in and welcome back. So today I'm going to take a look at something new. Uh, ASPA. I'm not sure if that's how it's said or it's pronounced. Or, uh, this was recommended in the comments. Um, so I went and looked up, tried to figure out what the name, the meaning of the name was. And I'm actually more confused than I was when I looked it up. It had something to do with an avatar and experience and both sides and meeting yourself in a new world or I was like, okay, well, whatever. <laughs> I mean, I'm not sure where they're going with that. Uh, so yeah, let's check this out. First, I saw that this thing I heard here is like, when I queued up the video, I was like, what is that? So I don't know. It's kind of bizarre. You want my A to the Z, but you won't. I'll be my G, my job, a sweet, gonna freak. What's hiding underneath? I feel I'm sorry to come on and not keep hanging up. So, oh, nah, you won't get it. Nah, nah, you won't get it. I say, hey, come back, hands on God, gonna thank you, you'll be mine. So I'm guessing now it's like a it's a thing. Like all the K-pop groups are have a rap part of their of their song. Um, I noticed from the early stuff that was not a part of it. But even in the last reaction I did to probably one of the groups that have been around the longest that I've reacted to is uh, it's twice, and they actually their last video I did, or most recent one I did, they had a kind of a rap part. So I guess that's kind of a thing now with these groups. So
Go. Yeah, I don't know what that is. I, at the one at the end, the blob at the end, I could tell that was spicy. That was spelling out that word. Um, and the first <laughs> really cool thing I saw was that pink Mustang. I was like, oh, my God, that's like, I don't know what year that was, but that's uh, definitely a 70s Mustang convertible uh, in pink, which is worth a lot of money, <laughs> to tell you the truth. But, uh, yeah, they've got a... They got the that kind of sound that you, you kind of hear now with all the their, their girl groups. You know, it's like it's uh, it's got the theirs was like probably half rap. Um, so uh, yeah, they're you know talented. Like all these groups, they all have like talented women and guys playing with them. Um, I'm learning that the uh, that all industries you know kind of is an ecosystem that you know produces you know just talented people one after the other um so i know they're um they're relatively new um i i saw i think they they started training in 2016 and and then i think they did their first thing around 2020 and had an album in 2021 and or 2022 and they did their first concert this year so um, yeah, they're just kind of starting to climb the charts. So interesting to see where they go and how it turns out for them. Um, so yeah, let me know what you think. Leave a comment down below. And if you found this interesting, like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you later. Bye.